Equation number 2. We're told a line has an equation y equals 3x minus 2. Part A of the question asks us to copy and complete the table below for this line. So the table has a row with x, a few x terms given, 3, 0 and negative 2. And we want to find the corresponding y values. And we get those by using the equation at the top. So the equation at the top tells us that we multiply the x values by 3 and then we subtract 2 which will give us our y value. So the first x value is 3, so multiplying that by 3, 3 threes are 9, then subtract 2 gives us 7, so our first value is 7. Our second x value is 0, so multiplying that by 3, 3 times 0 is 0, and 0 take away 2 is negative 2. Then our last x term, negative 2, Multiply that by 3. 3 times negative 2 is negative 6. Then subtract the negative 2 on the end gives us negative 8. So that uh, completes our table. Part B asks us to write down the gradient of the line. So in order to find the gradient of the line, what we do is use the gradient formula, which is m equals y2 take away y1 over x2 take away x1. In order to use this equation, we need two points, and what we have up here in our table is just that. That x and y term represents one point, here's another, and here's another. We just need two of the points, so I'm just going to select the first two, this one and this one. Now I'm going to write them down first of all. So the first one is x is 3 and y is 7, so we'll call that x1 and y1 and the second point uh, x is 0 and y is negative 2 so that will be our x2 and y2 substituting these values into our gradient formula we have m equals y2 which is negative 2 and we're subtracting y1 which is 7 divided by x2 which is 0 take away x1 which is 3 so that gives us m equals negative 2 take away 7 which is negative 9 divided by 0 take away 3 which is negative 3 so we now have a negative divided by a negative which means the answer will be positive and 9 divided by 3 is 3 so the gradient of the line is equal to 3 and that's our answer